So if someone at some point no longer started to, was no longer working in a position at a company uh-huh. and someone else had information on why that person no longer had position at a company, is that information that you'd be interested in? It'd be very much information I'd be interested in. Are I we would, playing a vague game right now? I would also. Are we playing the extremely vague game right this now? This is the vague game. Okay. Sometimes people are in positions, uh-huh. and sometimes in one day they do two something days. so poorly. At least two days. Well, two days they have the replacement. Uh-huh. So my guess is day <laughs> one he was called. They do so poorly that they are replaced. Uh huh. And sent home. I'm following you. I would like to know if our ones of ones and of ones of fans have any interest in giving some of this information to us. Uh, let us know. Because we are both very interested uh-huh. in whether or not someone may or may not hypothetically have had a position, lost a position, and now don't have a position anymore. Okay. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the Independent Rewind. My name is Steve Sarks. Yep. Mm-hmm. This, as always, my co-host, the Frosty, Rob, Rob Wells. Wells. And uh, if, if you want to answer those questions, people, uh, hit us up right here. Independent, Independent Rewind. Rewind. <laughs> Guys, send us emails, all that stuff. Remember, we do not watch these videos. We don't know what we're getting into. I'm so sorry if they're bad. I really hope they are. Uh, um, I hope they are. It's a, it's a new leaf. It's a new leaf, okay? We're going to try really hard now not to curse, okay? Mm-hmm. It just doesn't look good for who we are and what we're trying to get into. So It really, really helps not to curse on our March to 1,000. That's right, baby. The March to 1,000. If you are subscriber number 1,000, this guy will give you $1,000. Remember that as we march to 1,000. Is, is that legally binding? or? Yeah. I said it is happening. <laughs> okay. uh, he won't remember this episode, that's for sure. We'll give Speak, a, uh, listen, we get, we get a thousand subscribers, I'll give a thousand dollars. Really? To, to, the, to the thousandth guy? But no, no, not to oh. the thousandth guy, because then nobody's okay. going to join in until well, there's nine yeah, ones. Well. But, one of the thousand, we'll do a big giveaway. I'll give away a grand. You just keep wanting to give money away. Why don't you give me some money? <laughs> hey, uh, guys, if you are anywhere near the tri-state uh, Pennsylvania, Maryland, West Virginia Pennsylvania. area... Uh, and you have a ton of stuff. You go to your house and you're like, man, I've got all this stuff that I feel like might be worth something, but I definitely do not feel like going through everything. I don't have the time to set it up or the time to try and sell it. Hit up my boy, Craig Bumball, auctioneer in Waynesboro, Pennsylvania. He is happy to set it up for a small commission fee. He will auction it all off at top price and give you the money that you need and deserve. Hit him up, Craig Bumball, auctioneer. Did you get money for that sponsorship you just laid out there, by the way? Craig, first one's free, my guy. Next one's only, that's for sure. Anyway, speaking of being sponsored, which has nothing to do with this next video we're going to watch. Do we get money? If we get sponsored, yes. Send us money. That's how it is. But did they already do it? I know. You're the one that threw out the sponsorship, not me. Well, I know what was happening. Okay, anyway. I'm working on it. So where are we going this week? I got an angle. I, we're going to India. Oh my God! Are you it's serious? Not, it's not the same one from before. It's another one. If, uh, oh. I don't know where. I don't know God. where it's at. It's been okay. so long since yes. we've been to India. I have no idea how well this match is going to be. Uh, apologies to everybody if the commentary that might be on this is in a different language. I know one of the Imagine videos that. I looked up was that's for another country. Uh, our march to the thousand is going to take us across the world. That's right. In the next couple weeks, we're going to go through the. Couple countries got some uh, indie here, indie wrestling here, and um, I saw Turkish. Yeah, Turkish. Um, we're going to Russia, Russia and Europe. Europe, and I believe the Europe is, is ladies, European ladies. So they don't shave their pits. Okay. I don't know if that's true or not. I don't think so. <laughs> so anyway, let's go to the ring. Continental Wrestling Entertainment. So that's in English. Okay, that is. Oh. Look, we're oh my stuff. God! Please tell me the great colleagues of trainer. Name. No, there's no way. Shanky Singh. Guy looks pretty sizable. Yeah, uh, that's a big dude. Yeah, he doesn't look like he has a ton of definition, but neither do I. So that belt looks brand new because it has no folds no in it fold whatsoever. To it. <laughs> this guy looks like Indian Michael Jackson. Look at him. He looks at at any point in time he might <laughs> beat it. Can uh, can you tell what he's saying? Is he a face? He's smacking hands. Is this hands. me or is this a little loud? A little loud. A little, a little loud. 
turn it down a little bit. We gotta turn this back up. No, no, you don't want to overdraw on it too bad. No, no, but it's, it's yeah, he, they, they, they are a little loud. They yeah, little they, loud. they're just a little loud. I don't know why. All right. Hello. Hey, hey there, ring announcer girl. What's up, ring girl? Busting out in pants. Holy is cow. she got like a dress on, then pants underneath, or what's going on there? I, she, I, listen, I'll tell you what she is. She is hot fire. That's great. Kali is all over this place. Yeah, he, this must be. It's his all son. him. It's all him. You think this might be his son? He's got the facial features. Huh? <laughs> Wait, first wrestling academy in India. Okay. So yeah, great Kali must have his hand in this. Yeah. Let's see how good the training is. But look doing. how old the the the, the apron is. That yeah. apron looks old. Probably bought an old WWE ring. <laughs> what are you doing? Oh, he slipped. Oh. Can we call that oh, Pearl Harbor? <laughs> yeah. So we know who the heel is. Good oh, wow. God. He is over. Oh, tell me you put a three-minute match in here. No, I did not put that a That was a hell of a big boot. Oh, look at that. He's doing his job there. Wow, already. Yes. Is that a... Wait, what flag is that? Looks like green flag. Are we going? That's the old Mexicutioner. <laughs> the Mexicutioner. The old Mexicutioner on the side <laughs> of the ring. Shane, if you're watching... Book it. I got Book you. Book it. The Mexicutioner. Shane loves to... Book me and Matt. Holy shit. Sorry. Crap. There we go. It's a new lead for Steven. I was only the S word. <laughs> Holy cannolis. The size difference in these guys is massive. Yeah. This guy seems like he can actually he can work. Act, yeah, he can work like a big guy. This is great. This guy is real. Now, and I'm wondering if this is just a, a, a like a, a spotlight match for him. I'm hoping to Maybe. see something out of our heel here. Ooh. Dude, man, knows how to take a buckle. Oh, Mexicutioner in. Checking on his man. <laughs> My executioner's in some serious trouble here. And a big spear. No. Oh. Uh, I Kicked him in like the knee. Kicked him in the knee. I'll give it to him. Yeah, that wasn't bad. Uh, Although I think he oversold a little bit. There we go. We're going to work on the legs. Yep. As you should. It's a big guy. Let's take him off his feet. Good drop kick. Yep. He didn't, he didn't go down. Which Come on. Good. He's feeding the leg. Give him the chop right. block. Give him the old chop block. Woo! <laughs> is he slapping his leg when he kicks him in the leg? Bringing up the massive tree trunk he's got going on there. There you go. Creative. Oh, nice. He's, he's favoring that leg. There's the chop There's block. There's the chop block. He needs to get him again now. Like, get him out in the middle of the ring to that chop block. That'll really look nice. Uh, you got to get him on something else. Pull him out there and yeah. work a hold on this, okay? There's that chop block. I don't know if this guy can is is uh, selling very well. He might be playing possum. Uh, what? You just pushed what? him up, Nate. What? That makes no sense. Strike him. Yeah, when you yeah. push him up like that, give him give him a yeah. solid strike and then step back. Here we go. He's gonna turn he's gonna go into it one one too many times. He's about to take a big bump. Mm -hmm. Big bump right here. Oh no. There was a slap there when he grabbed his neck. Oh no. This guy's he's this gotta is not be like well. Collie's Oh, or he took like it that. easy on him. I heard big chop. This guy's massive. He is. Oh, God. That right hand looks so it devastating. It did. It looked so, like... Mm. Man, guy he's throwing throw a punch, punch yeah. so fast. Throws how, knows how to throw a punch. Guy, guy can't get knows how to sell it well. Like, Here's what gets me. I can't throw a punch anywhere near that fast. Yeah. Oh, the executioner, he's back up there. He doesn't have his flag this time. Just lay into him. You gotta hit him at some point. Yeah, that's... Oh, there's the flag. That's why. Here we go. The old cheap shot. Oh, he put his hands up. Oh, why'd you put your hands up? He's still not down. Hit him with the next factor. 
No, here's where he gets caught in the choke slam. Blockbuster. Oh, it's got to be a choke slam. Oh, he I did call a blockbuster, didn't I? He almost didn't I did get call over. a blockbuster. Hot diggity. He almost did not get over. He's down, man. Make a pen. Make a pen. The old Bollywood blockbuster. Mm. Nope. Not today. You know what? Here's the thing. I don't think that the uh, the manager is very creative in what he's doing. Mm -mm. But man, are they making this a competitive match? Crowds into it. Yeah. I like this arena, by the way. I love this. I don't know where it's at, but I like the layout. India is my guess. I dig this. Oh, go, go for it. Get him. Oh, oh it's shaky legs. Shaky legs coming up. Oh, nope. Hurt his back. See, that's a face move there. Don't do not don't do that. Ah, boom. Good <laughs> God. And now. You can take that to the bank and cash it. Good God. <laughs> this guy's athletic as all get out. Yeah, I'm surprised we never heard of this guy. Like He's really He's got to be doing something. I bet, I bet WWE already has already has their hands on this guy. Probably. They better, because, I mean... Holy shit. Mm. Some honey on that. Two. Oh, he pulled him out. Gonna save his man. Executioner, get right in there. Is the executioner a male or female? I do not know. I'm wondering I that now. I thought I saw some references there. Slides. Uh-huh. Come on, get him up. Get him up. I was gonna be count out. Yeah, it's a count out. Holy crap. I didn't think they were I thought he was gonna throw him at the last second, but Gotta be a guy. There's two male boys. Okay, first off, you don't know. Okay. Shanky Singh. Are we, we pulling it up? I'm looking him up. Let's okay. do it. Alright, let's look him up. Meanwhile, I'll entertain the fans singing over here. La -di -di. Oh, he, Indian professional wrestler. It pulls right up. Oh, did it? Okay. And? Currently signed to WWE, where he performs on the Raw brand under the ring name Shanky. He's a former Bollywood actor. I've never seen Shanky, have you? Probably dark matches. Probably dark matches. I gotta be getting ready for something with him, right? Great Khali does own CWE. Okay. And? Hold on. And then? Pulling his Wikipedia up. Inquiring minds want to know. I know. Seven foot one is what he's built at. Uh-huh. It's trained by the Performance Center. So he was trained. Former at, Bollywood actor in 2017 interviewed to... He said that his dream was to join WWE and defeat Brock Lesnar. <laughs> okay, you uh, either sing, Shanky, or whatever your name is. Keep dreaming. Okay. 2015, he joined CWE. Mm-hmm. Um... Is that it? Hold on. You gotta read faster, man. We're semi live. Uh, man, you better settle down. <laughs> March 2017, uh -huh. he uh -huh. did a WWE tryout in Dubai. Uh -huh. Wasn't that around the time all those guys got stuck Oh, in the Dubai? Indian police officer. We saw something on that? Yeah, yeah. Okay. That's right before he got signed to WWE. Oh, okay. Cool. He choke slammed an Indian police officer. Uh huh. And some pedestrians and soon escaped with his bike because Pandy Orson stuff is pushed up in the middle of the street. Okay, that's 
weird. Hmm. Uh, so, this is awesome. Hmm. Also, they signed, like, Mahorta. Yes. Oh, no, sorry. So, two other people they, they signed. Do you see this? Hey, on the May 10th episode of Raw, Shanky along with Veer would align themselves with Jinder Mahal. Oh, okay, you know, I think I saw that. Uh, clips of it, anyway. Okay, yeah. What, but, what about it? Anyway. What do you give this match, man? What's, what's, what's our temperature here? Um, I mean, it's short and sweet, obviously. 85 no degrees. Sided. 85 degrees. This is a good, warm match. It did its job very well. I was entertained through the whole thing. The moves looked good. Psychology was decent. The manager was kind of shite. Okay, uh-huh. wasn't great. I wasn't a fan of the manager or the manager spots. I think you could have gave the heel a little bit more, uh, and it would have worked out better, sold a little bit better. But chances are they're really trying to protect Shanky, uh-huh. so him going down was not something they really wanted to do. Right. Um, but God bless America, that looked good. So eighty five degrees. So that was that yeah. Was solid. I'm, I'm gonna give it around an eighty two because it was eighty two. You it was, no, it's around an eighty. I said it, it was just. It was. It was a very entertaining match. It was short, kind of short and sweet, and it was, you know, everything it needed to be. It got uh, Shanky over. Um, like I really would have liked to see that chop block in the center of the ring, though. I would like to see. I'd like to see that, but eh, it is what it is. I mean, it worked. So. Guys, thank you so much for tuning in. We appreciate it. Please like and subscribe to the video. Send us messages mm-hmm. at Independent Rewind. Do not forget to check out Craig Bombaugh Auctioneer in Waynesboro, Pennsylvania. Pokemon cards, trading collectibles, uh-huh. video games, everything. Anything you want to sell. Anything You got baseball cards but don't feel like going through them. Check out Craig Bombaugh Auctioneer, Waynesboro, Pennsylvania. Thanks, guys. And uh, thanks for tuning in to Independent Rewind. We'll see you next week. Later.